Okay, awesome. So Jenny is one of my clients that I've been working with for the last about six months mm -hmm. and has been doing some awesome things in her business. And so I wanted you to come on today and just share a little bit about your journey and what it is you do and just kind of tell us about how things have changed in your business because I think it's it's helpful for other coaches to hear your experience as well. So um, if you want to just start and tell us like just a little bit about you and what it is that you do in your business, like that would be awesome. Okay. Um, so the name of my business is Vibrant Energy Now. And um, I guess it was about six months ago when I started working with Kristen that I decided through her guidance that I would specialize in helping with people that are recovering from mold illness because that was one of the biggest things that I had um, had to overcome with my own health struggles. Yeah. And so now um, I have a group called Mold Illness Recovery and I really help people with a very comprehensive, holistic program that addresses all the different factors that can affect someone's healing from a chronic illness like this. And so it's been amazing to integrate everything I've learned from functional medicine testing, which was the first modality I was trained in, to now bring in the mindset component, mm -hmm. which I was you know, really familiar with, but getting into Kristen's program, that just really brought to the forefront for me how critical that is for anything, whether it's building a business or getting better, yeah. that mindset piece is so important. So I bring that in to my programs. And then I also bring in energetic testing and something called bioenergetics, look at the diet, lifestyle, all that. Um, but people now, instead of just calling me when they're having a crisis and wanting one session here and there, they're now enrolling in a 12 ses session package that they have to use within four months. Um, and it really um, has been amazing for people sticking with it, you know, being consistent. They put down some money. It's a big investment. So they want to, you yeah. know, get the results for that. And so it's been much better for me, but I'm also seeing much more profound results for my clients. And so that just is really where I feel good about it. Yeah. I love yeah. all of that so much. And so why don't you give us just like, I know we kind of covered, you kind of covered this and what you just talked about, but like a little bit of a snapshot of where you were at when we started working together and why, you know, we ended up, why you ended up hiring me and why we ended up working together. <laughs> Yeah. What was going on for you? Yeah. Um, so I've been doing coaching probably on and off for five years. I was a dental hygienist for 25 years prior to that and then got sick and yeah. Yeah. I wanted to help people with everything I was learning, but it was a lot of stop and start and stop and start and um, trying to find the niche, you know, <laughs> and there was a couple things I tried that didn't fully resonate. So I didn't put all my heart into it. And then I guess just my health was at a point where I was feeling really strong. I'm like, okay, I'm ready to just really take off with this business. I'm tired of kind of playing with it and having to be a hobby. And, yeah. you know, I want to contribute to our household income. So that's when I started looking on YouTube for a business coach. And that's how I found you, Kristen. And um, just everything that you talked about really resonated. Your personality resonated with me. You know, being an introvert, I could relate to that. And yeah. there was just, it's almost like an intuitive thing. It's just like, okay, I'm going to set up this appointment for the free business, you know, breakthrough session. And I'll probably say no, but I just want to hear what she has to say. And then that just something, the way you walked me through it and made me realize that I'm ready for this. It's worth the investment. And there was no pressure at all. But then by the end, when she, you said the price, and I was like, oh, there's no reason why I shouldn't do this. And I just, at that point, I, I knew by the end of the call, I had to sign up for you. Yeah. And so I did. And um, really, the, the business prior to working with you was not making much money. It, I was attracting kind of just anybody that wanted help with anything. And so I felt overwhelmed sometimes, like, 
I don't even know how to help this person. Yeah. Um, and there was, I, I think it was because of my mindset feeling kind of desperate to make money. I was attracting people who were um, challenging <laughs> to say the least, yeah. you know, didn't have good mindset and, you know, just kind of complainers and they didn't even believe they could heal. So how was I going to help them? Um, so that was really frustrating. And there were times where I'm just like, I can't do this anymore. These people are just, you know, they're taxing me and bringing me yeah. down. And so I don't even know if I want to be a health coach. Mm. Um, yeah. So was there something else that you wanted to know about prior to, I guess the, the, the appointments were just um, hit and miss. You know, I, I, I was very nervous to ask for even $700 up front, let alone, you know, thousands of dollars. Yeah. Yeah. And so that, you know, my money mindset was really getting in the way too. Mm. So um, working with you has shifted all of that. And now I can say, you know, that'll be $2,500 and I don't break a sweat. You know, I'm just awesome. very confident that's going to be great for them. Yeah. That's amazing. Like all those things are, are so great. And I, I do remember like one of the big things, because I think this kind of happens with a lot of people. If you don't have that ideal client too, like you're spending a lot of time preparing for the calls and like doing research afterwards, because you're helping everyone with the different things. Yeah. So now like you've really been able to like streamline things. and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And it's better for my just focus to, yeah. you know, I, I have all these modalities and knowledge that I've gained over the years, but to really spend my time reading books, researching, being in other groups that are specifically for mold illness. Hmm. I think it's helped my mind not feel so overwhelmed and really zoning in on this. Yeah, definitely, definitely. So give us a little bit, and you already told us a little bit, but give us a little bit of a snapshot as far as where you are right now with your business, what's going on, what's changed for you. Um, you talked about some of the things just with what you're charging and stuff, but. Give us just like a little bit of a breakdown of what, what's changed for you. Pretty much everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I mean, um, you know, through the private Facebook group that um, you bring us into. Yeah. Um, I learned all about Facebook marketing. So I got that in place. I got the funnel in place. I created my own, besides my, my business page, which I had been contemplating mold illness prior to consulting with you but i was nervous because it's it's still kind of poo-pooed in the conventional yeah. <laughs> world is you know fake illness it's not real and so i was almost embarrassed to put it out there but once i committed to okay mold illness is my niche i you know i had this experience i know it's real i've seen the research then i created my own business page that has the word mold illness recovery coach in it. So I became known as that. And then yeah. you encouraged us to create our private Facebook group for people that, you know, have to ask to be joined. And that way people see what I'm doing. They get to know me. Um, they see how I work. And so the ones that are now calling me for a free little mini coaching session kind of most of them already know what I'm all about. So I don't have to explain that. I don't have to say, you know, you're, you're not my type of person or they yeah. have to find out that I do woo woo weird stuff. <laughs> you know, they already see that because I've okay. created this group and way for them to get to know me. That's awesome. Yeah. What else? Um, well, so you, you talked a little bit about like your charging. So what were you doing as far as like session? I can't remember were you, were you doing like per session or? Yeah, it was pretty much every once in a while I would try to get someone to invest in a package okay. where they functional medicine testing and they, you know, buy, you know, three to six sessions with me or something like that. But um, didn't have a lot of takers for that. And I think it was the way I was presenting it. And I was yeah. always thinking, oh, this person can't afford it. And am I worth it? You know, that kind of thing. Yeah. Um, so, but now, um, and I think, you know, a big benefit of working with you and the other women entrepreneurs in your group is seeing that people can do this. There are lots of people, the whole world, you know, when you're online, the whole world is, you know, potential for 
someone who has the resources, has the motivation to put down, you know, a fairly good size uh, investment to get the results they want. So that helped me believe in it. And I did, you know, some mindset work around my money, kind of limited thinking on that. And, oh, Kristen, your script for doing the sales call yeah, that has been the biggest help for me on getting those calls um, where I'm not coming from a place of desperation because people yeah. pick up on that. I'm not trying to sell myself. I'm really listening. I'm also taking my ego out of the equation and just saying, how can I serve you? And yeah. listening and reflecting back to them. And so then when we get to the end of the call, you know, I try to see where they're at. And if they sound interested, I'm like, would you like to know more? Would you like to know the price? And there's no even like quiver in my voice when I say the price, because I, I, I know that if, if it's a good fit, they're going to want it and they're going to find a way to pay for it. And it's going to be so worth it for them. Awesome. So that's been huge. It's like a big monkey off my shoulder not to have that money hang up. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. And so, and what are you charging now for your program? I think you said, is it 2,500? It is 2,500. Yeah. And then there's some incentive if they pay within 24 hours, they get a little discount on that. Awesome. Um, They have a a choice of doing some monthly payments that might cost them a little bit more to have to break it up into three months. Um, most people, when they hear the discount are now just saying, here's my credit card number, which until I met you, I never even dreamed of asking for a credit card number over the phone, <laughs> but if people want it, they're, they're like, yeah. And so I just punch it into my, you know, square and awesome. And yeah. So having a consistent monthly income has been amazing. My husband's so happy <laughs> that awesome. we have that coming in and that affords me time to get even more advanced training that I've been wanting that I had to hold off on because I couldn't afford it. Mm -hmm. I've also hired people to help me with my website instead of me trying to figure it all out myself, which was just such a waste of time. Yeah. 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 So the investment has paid off, you know, probably 10 times already. I love it. It's worth every penny. penny. Oh, that's awesome. And I'm so excited for you. And and tell us like a little bit about, you just had like an opportunity come your way to um, um, someone, tell me a little bit about that. I know you had mentioned it, but I think that's yeah. Really- so this was not something I was looking for at all, Yeah. Um, but I have a feeling that me kind of being more um, visible on social media, interacting with people, I'm kind of getting known now as the mold illness person. <laughs> yeah. Um, And also I just, I believe quite strongly in law of attraction and putting energy out into the universe. And so um, through everything I've learned from you, I believe that this very successful, prominent um, health coach reached out to me because she saw what I was doing and she offered to train me for six months at no charge (laughs) to me, which is unheard of. (laughs) <laughs> and yeah. I, you know, a lot of money to get trained by these kind of people, but she was impressed with what I'm doing. And so um, I'm in her training program and then I will become one of her um, practitioners that is listed on her website as someone that can, the uh, people that follow this woman can book an appointment for a consultation with. And she does all the advertising. She finds us the clients. Um, and it can be whatever hours I want it to be. So I'm not giving up my business at all for this, but yeah. it's going to be a part-time thing that, you know, I'm learning incredible information from her and I have a little other source of income as being one of her trained practitioners. So I don't think that she would have reached out if I hadn't, you know, been out on Facebook and everything. So yeah, invisible. <laughs> Yeah, that's exciting. I'm I'm very excited for you and a big testament to all that you're doing, getting visible. I mean, obviously getting amazing results for your clients and um, yeah, it's, it's all great. Yeah. Well, getting visible is, um, you know, it's a hurdle for a lot of us introverts that we have to 
push through and you gave me a lot of confidence and watching the other women in the group post their Facebook lives and their welcome video for their group, you know, that just, I could see that everybody was having a hard time. Even the women that I thought looked perfect and beautiful, they all were like, ah, oh, this is cringeworthy. I hate doing <laughs> like, okay, well, if they have a hard time too, then I can be, you know, a little forgiving on myself if I don't, you know, feel real great. But just the more you do it, the easier it gets. And you just have to push past that fear. Yeah. Yeah. And you did yeah, awesome with that. It. Yeah. Cause I remember that first video was like, <laughs> oh God. Yeah. <laughs> Not fun at all. And I still get the, you know, little flutters in my heart and my yeah. stuff and everything, but, um, I'm learning to cope with that. And, and I think video, like you've told, told us is really like so important for people to get to know you. You can write the best blogs and yeah. newsletters and stuff, but video is where it's at these days definitely you have to do it you have to do it yeah yeah it, it really helps you like build that connection with someone yeah if i hadn't seen your video on youtube i don't think i would have reached out just from reading your website yeah yeah no i agree i think videos it's powerful for sure mm -hmm. yeah um awesome so all really good stuff um and i'm super excited for you Anything else that's like really shifted for you, even like outside of your business, just like personally, maybe even since we started working together? Yeah, I mean, I don't know who to give credit to, but. <laughs> well, <laughs> you. Actually, <laughs> but... you know what I think is that um, even though I've known for years about journaling and having a morning routine, I never stuck with it, never stuck with it. But being in your group, there was this sense of, being accountable to people <laughs> that we're all doing this together. And so I really committed to at least 15 minutes of a morning routine where I do, I bought um, the passion planner, I think was what yeah. you were I got that. And so I journal in the morning and I set the intention for the day and I do at least a 10 minute little guided meditation and a little energy medicine routine. But I stuck with that and I just saw shifts in many relationships, friendships, mm. my marriage. My marriage was kind of actually on the rocks a little bit. I remember <laughs> and, you mentioning that. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah. In fact, yeah, now that I think about it, our, our call, I was like, oh, I don't even know if I'm staying with my husband, yeah. so I don't know if I can afford this. But um, it kind of inspired me to get some family counseling. And so our marriage is great. That's my awesome. relationship with my kids is better. So it's like been just a transformation in many ways. I love all of that. Yeah. So yeah. And I feel better about myself because, you know, I don't feel like this loser that's mooching money off my husband every month because I can't make my business, you know, get enough money to make it worth even doing. It started to feel like I was losing money. Yeah. And that didn't feel good. Yeah. And I hear that a lot. And I think us as women, especially like, I don't personally have this experience of having been like a stay at home or a mom, but I think so many women have this experience of doing that or not being the one that's maybe the breadwinner and really wanting to like make your own money and kind of have that, that freedom that comes with that. And I think there's like, how does it feel to like be able to just like make your own money and be like, yeah, I can charge people and like, they're going to pay me and I have like this amazing service. I think it's like, just, it feels really awesome. Yeah. It feels like a blessing in many ways. Cause I yeah. know so many people are in these horrible jobs that they hate and it's hurting their health. It's hurting their spirit. Yeah. And especially women. I mean, you just, you, you might have a husband that's supporting you, but you just never know what's going to happen. Yeah. You know, you could, lose that person you could get divorced whatever and it just it's a sense of security and peace of mind that you can do this business that you love and you can make enough money to support yourself and i have aspirations that's just going to keep getting better and better so i can start doing the world traveling i want to do and love it. you know just yeah keep getting to the next level and i can see from watching you that it just keeps growing and growing. You build your audience. 
um, you can do group programs eventually, which is what I want to do. Definitely. So, um, yeah, sky's the limit. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm excited for you. Um, awesome. So what would you say to anyone who is considering working with me or with a, with a coach, like, at, or me as their business coach, I would say, let's talk about me specifically. <laughs> like, if someone's on the edge and they're pondering, but they're like, I don't know if I can really do this. I don't know if she can really help me. Like, what would you say to someone who is maybe like in your shoes when you were thinking about working with me, but you were, you know, kind of hesitant perhaps? Right, right. Um, well, first thing, of course, is to jump on the call with you because that's how someone's going to really see, you know, of course, they're going to first tell you where they're at and their story and their goals and everything. But then um, you give feedback that, really you know it either resonates or it doesn't yeah and if you're the right person i think people know pretty quickly that this feels good and that helps you make that decision um, if you can really tap into your intuition on that and then you know just make the decision and feel good about it know that you're going to commit to it you know you, you put down some money and so you don't want that to be wasted yeah and you're gonna have someone that's going to be holding your hand walking you through a very tried and true roadmap on how to do it because it's so confusing when you get online try to forget that this stuff out it's just like ah, who do i listen to but you have it all spelled out we've got these modules you give us lifetime access to the modules which was amazing yeah. um, and you have other women i met women in, in your group that now are my friends and my cheerleader. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. It's, yeah, I mean, it's can be scary to put down, you know, money in your business like this, but I don't know anybody who's got, you know, fairly good sized business that hasn't done this kind of investment in a coach or some yeah. kind of business training. It's, it's just kind of, you need it. You just can't do it by yourself. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, if you're at that point where you want to get to the next level, I highly encourage it. And um, Kristen is just so um, gentle with you. You know, you're never like mean or bossy. Or <laughs> you, you try to pull out what the person is, you know, wanting for themselves and you gently guide us. And you have so many resources on the Facebook group and um, just your, your resources in, in the, um, training. So, um, yeah, I think it's just an amazing investment and I highly encourage women to do it. Well, I don't think you'll be sorry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Um, what about like, do you have any last words of wisdom to, to other coaches, to new coaches who are maybe just getting started? Um, you know, maybe are, are kind of doubting themselves. Can I really do this in the, in my business? Can I really make money, get clients, get good results? Like any words of wisdom that you would just want to give to, to people in that position? Um, well, I guess what we just talked about is investing, <laughs> investing yeah. in help because yeah. yeah, you can kind of limp along and try to figure out yourself to a certain degree, but, um, I don't know. I, I just think it's hard to really make it profitable at, at that pace. And so you need some guidance. You need to find someone that really um, resonates with your personality and your learning style. And um, yeah, just know that if you don't make that investment, it's probably going to be a really slow growth for you. <laughs> And, and you do help us with all these other things that are so, so important, the mindset and finding your niche and attracting the right kind of clients that make your business fun for you. Wow. Something you look forward to doing, not something you're just like, uh, <laughs> I hate this. Why did I do it? Yeah. That's the last thing you want is to build a business that you don't like. Like that. Yeah. 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 And so, um, I like your balanced approach. You know, it's not like all intellectual type of business dry stuff. I mean, you have the the hardcore things that we need to know, yeah. but you bring in this energetic part of it that for me is really, really important, maybe even more important <laughs> than the systems and stuff. 
Yeah. So, so if people are into that, I think, um, you know, really explore those things. And that book that you recommended, Playing the Matrix, yeah. Mike Dooley? Mike Dooley? Dooley, yeah. Yeah, that was really a shift for me too. Awesome. Yeah. That's a good one. Yeah, I love that book. It's a, definitely a good one. Um, awesome. Well, thank you so much for sharing all that. Um, why don't you tell us if people are interested in, in seeing what you're up to, like checking out your your content, because um, there may be people that need your support too, or have people that they could refer to you. Do you, where can people find you? Where's the best place for people to? Oh, okay. To you? Great. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, so my website is moldillnessrecovery.com. Awesome. And then on Facebook, I have mold illness recovery coach is my business page. Okay. And then from that business page, people can click on the top to go to the private group and ask to join. Awesome. And so we get, you know, a lot of information there. Um, I'm going to be doing more Facebook live soon once I <laughs> up on a few things. Yeah. It's just, there's not enough hours in the day. Um, and I'm on Instagram too, as mold illness recovery coach. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. And I'll, I'll put that like in the notes so people can find it easily. So, yeah. And I do offer a, um, 45 minute little free mini coaching session. If you know, someone wants to let me know what their goals are and what they're struggling with. And I can, you know, talk about how I might be able to guide them on that, assist them. And awesome. if it feels good, you know, we could maybe work together. Definitely. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much, Jenny, for sharing all that. And I, I appreciate it so much. And I know so many other people are going to find it super helpful because we're all kind of in the same spot when we're getting started and we all have fears and doubts and we're like, can I really do this? Uh, can I make the money I want? Can I really get the clients and like my business? And you are proof that you can. So. <laughs> yes, it's doable. It's very yeah. doable. Yeah. yeah, it's very inspiring. So thank you so, so much. And um, yeah, to everyone that's watching, like, yeah, just be inspired by Jenny and, and know that you can do the same things. So. Yeah. And you're never too old. <laughs> yes, exactly. 57, 57 years old. Yeah. And some people are ready to slow down at that point. But for me, I feel like I'm just launching a new phase in my life. Yeah. And I'm not slowing down at all. <laughs> I love that. I love that yeah. so much. I think that's what's so amazing about creating like a business that you actually love and you're passionate about. Cause it's not like, Oh, I just want to retire. or I want to like, you know, retire as soon as possible, or I'm just going to do this job until I retire. Like I can make a job that I actually like, and I can do it as long as I want. And I can decide to stop whenever I want. Yep. So, yep. And take long vacations when you want. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You get the best of, of both worlds. And I think doing some working, you know, is, is good because it keeps your, your brain active and <laughs> yeah. Well, you something you. like work towards. <laughs> Thank you, Kristen. I'm just so, so grateful for all the help that you've given me. And um, yeah, it's just priceless, really. So I wish you all the best with what you're doing and you're helping so many women. It's just a revolution. Oh, thank you, Jenny. You're so welcome. And thank you so much for sharing. With sure, my pleasure.